All right, so we got a few shrimp going on here. This one right there, it's a Bloody Mary cherry shrimp. Uh, right here is a yellow Neo Caradina. And right here, that's creeping. Oh, here's an orange Neo Caradina that's buried. Look, she is pregnant. See all those little spheres? That means she is getting ready. And I did see a molt in here, so those are ready to go. Now, this red and clear one right here that's called a red really all right and uh so and i i do have some babies in here the babies are really hard oh, oh before we miss it that is a blackberry neo caradina and just to the right of that right there that is a blue bolt caradina and right now i'm gonna have some shrimp guys freaking out being like you have them in the same tank and parameters are all gonna die they've been living together for months i did my due diligence to figure out what to do to have everyone live at the same parameters but it can be done that's a baby cherry shrimp let's see if we can score oh you know what sometimes they're dangling upside down Well, I think that might be the conclusion, but so there, there she is, and you can see she's, well, she's eating. That's food right now. That's a uh, calcium enriched food. Uh, I did have a, um, a failed molt, but it wasn't due to the lack. Oh, right here before I miss it. Blue dream. All right. These are the stars of the show. The blue dream Neo Caradinas. There's a blackberry swimming behind it. Now, th this tank is big. It's hard to tell that there are, you know, 40 plus shrimp in here. But from a view, it, I, if I catch them first thing in the morning, I'll see just like shrimp everywhere. And sometimes in this moss, I will see the little speck babies. I mean, they are tiny. I mean, smaller than a granule of rice. It's You could be staring right at one for like <laughs> an hour and not even realize, oh, there's the molt. So if we look right there, that's how I know the female is about to drop those those eggs. Anyway, so I just wanted to talk about a few different... Oh, we're getting a close-up of her eggs right here. See that? So I don't know uh, who she bred with. Now, there... As a personal reason as to why I have all these different types of uh, neo caradinas and caradinas um, mixed together, um, it's it's not that I don't know the result when they crossbreed because when they crossbreed, it does cause them to regress back to their wild form, which is kind of a brownish red. You know, they're all they're all descendants of red cherry shrimp. Um, you know, so just humans, we've done this. Oh, I got two. She's pregnant too. All right. That's what I'm talking about. See, I can't even get out the facts. I'm getting excited this morning. Although, I'm not surprised the pregnant ones are hanging out over here because those little, uh, these, those little specks right there, that's actually shrimp food. And it's enriched with protein and calcium, specifically for, uh, shrimp that are buried, like this one. See all her little yellow eggs under her belly? And that one too. They need a lot of protein and calcium because if they have a failed molt right before they're about to give birth, well, that means all the babies are going to go also. So, um, you know, uh, a lot of work in a shrimp. And I'll get more into detail of that. This is just me kind of going around the tank and showing all the different kinds that are in here. And there are more than that. I mean, there's bamboo. There's one bamboo shrimp in here. I only have one because he's larger than even all the fish. And you'll see... There are just dozens of babies up here. Some are older than others. Oh, there's babies everywhere. They've all found their little spot. See, there's a baby in there back there too. But yeah, the, the shrimp. Oh, okay. All right. Here's a baby shrimp. Right there. Right there on that leaf. And that's actually a juvenile. When they're first born, I mean, they're like a speck of dust. Um, it's, it's really hard to tell what you're looking at until, until it moves, but 
Yep, that's it. That's. Let's see if I can get even closer where it'll. Well, on the camera on my phone's not that great, but anyway. So, uh, if you have any particular questions, go ahead. It, you know, this I knew was going to be quick because the shrimp they will just disperse and they vanish as soon as daylight happens. They all want to kind of uh, start hiding under their leaves and whatnot. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hey, what's going on, dude? Hi. Say hello. Hi. Hello, YouTube. Hello. I'm uh, telling all our internet friends about our different shrimp in here. Cool. Yep. So, anyway, say thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Say hit the like button and subscribe, please. My dad shows cool videos about plants and shrimp. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> okay. Thanks, bud. All right. I uh, hope everyone has a fantastic day. Uh, thanks again.